everybody, welcome back to the range. Got some more ammunition from SG Ammo to test today. Today we have our PMC 556 M193 equivalent. We have our 10, our 16, and 20 inch barrel. Pro Chrono Pal Chrono as always, 10 to 12 feet. It's 80 degrees outside today. Up first is our 20 inch AR with the 1 and 9 twist barrel. I told you I'd do it to you, and I'd do it to you again. Thirty-two oh five, thirty-one hundred, thirty seventy-nine, thirty-one hundred, thirty ninety-three, thirty-one oh eight, thirty-one twenty-two, thirty-one fifteen, thirty-one fifty-two, thirty-one oh eight. Now our stag, 16 inch, one and nine twist. 30, 03, 29.96, 29.82, 30.03, 29.89, 29.76, 30.03, 30.09, 3023, 3003. And finally, our 10 inch barrel, M85 PAP. 2614, 25.59, 25.94, 25.59, 25.83, 26.14, 2645, 2544, 2578, 2588, and that's it. Here's the PMC M193. One, two, three, four, five. Looks like right around inch and a half to maybe inch and three quarters. Maybe a little less in there. These two definitely are the outliers there. These weren't bad. One and nine twist stag, 16 inch with a non-magnified EOTech, minimal wind at 75 yards. Let's take a second grouping and see if it's any better. One, two, three, four, and we've got that one down there at five. So right around a little over inch and a half, maybe inch and three quarters there. Definitely less if you throw out that bottom guy there, but not bad. Well, there you have it. Solid 5.56 velocities out of the PMC x -Tech. Not what we've seen in some of the higher end offerings that CBC that we chronographed on the same day here was a lot faster. Accuracy was acceptable at 1.75 inches, again, for what I'm doing at 75 yards. Again, as always, I'd like to thank Sam and SGMO for providing us with ammunition for us to test and chronograph for you guys to have information. Until next time, catch you at the range.